sometimes the answer to a simple question can be very surprising. For example, when I was at my friend's farm, I asked him, what's that? And I pointed to a heap of grass in a pit near the cow barn, and he replied, that's the dead cow pit. I didn't really know what to say, so I said, (sighs) cool. Then we just moved on. Now, I know my reply didn't exactly indicate that I was interested in the dead cow pit, but in my opinion, it's on the host to really suss out if the guest is interested in the dead cow pit. Dead cow pits are not common, and so the manners surrounding them are not well known. Is a dead cow pit a sort of farming technology that needs to be guarded, and asking about it might make the farmer defensive? Are these city folks so removed from agrarian practice that they thought we had like a cow graveyard and now they're just reeling from the realization that cows live mere feet from where they will be laid to rest for eternity? Oftentimes our assumptions are wrong. Personally, I was really interested in the dead cow pit and I still hold it against my farmer friend that he never asked me if I wanted to see how it all worked. So... My pro tip here is sometimes your answer should be followed by a question in case the person you answered wants to see the dead cow pit closer. Yeah, and that's just being a good host. It's It's on you. Yeah. I understand, like I said, that a response like cool isn't like, hey, I I could have asked. Could I see how how does it work? (laughs) I mean, it's to me, it sounds like cool. Like there's like an inviting like... Go on. Maybe like, I wasn't uh, effusive yeah. enough with that. Like, How'd you, cool. Well, and maybe I mean, if if you had if you'd said what's that, and he's like, it's a shovel, and you're like, cool. Like, had you said cool to everything <laughs> that he pointed <laughs> out previously? previously? Cause you that might, might have a point there. Yeah, you might have a point. Make it yeah, kind of like, tricky for him to be like, oh, so let's dig in. No pun intended. On the shovel, like, right? Let's right. dig in on right yeah, the, the dead cow pit. The dead yeah, cow Yeah, because he was like. I got to his house and uh-huh. and uh, and he has a big you know big huge building there next to his house and I was yeah. like what's that? Yeah. He's like, no, that's a barn. It's a barn. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. And, but you know, but it is and weird I said, that I it, said, cool. Yeah. yeah. It is weird that in none of these situations he was like, you want to see how the barn works <laughs> or you want <laughs> right. to see how the shovel works? Right. Right. Well, like it, it, that's the weird thing though. We ended up near the barn. Right. I don't remember exactly why. Maybe it was like I asked about something farther away. Uh-huh. Like, mm-hmm. What's that? And then right. he was like, well, let's go look at it. Yeah, right. Yeah. And then I could tell you more what it is. Yeah. And so well, that's kind of what hanging out with this guy was, is it was me kind of coming over and saying, what's that? Hold on, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But that's but but it's also just one of those, that's one of those things that develops your ability to first, the first step is ask, what's that? Yeah, <laughs> what's that? <laughs> then, Don't be afraid if, to ask what's that. Eventually, like that's a good starting place. Eventually, you know, you were how old? Uh, like like 8, 10, somewhere? No, I was older. I was probably like like 18 or 18. 17. Okay, so you're 17 or 18. Yeah. <laughs> Please explain the bar to me. Yeah, yeah. What yeah. is that? Yeah. You know, mm-hmm. okay. I mean, I look, I I had ideas in my mm-hmm. head about what it mm-hmm. is. Cow sure. house. Yeah. Um, you know, and that's basically what it is, right? Right, right. I mean, a a barn is a cow house, cow bathroom, cow, you know, what I found out, graveyard, sure, in some sense, like all in one, basically, pretty close, pretty close to each other. Cow, um, uh, uh, a nurse room, nursing room, yeah, the lactation nursery, yeah, lactation room, right, (laughs) procreation chambers, (laughs) yeah, as well. It's all one. Yeah. It all works together. Yeah. And the boss of it all, the farmer. Advanced Answering Techniques. Hello and welcome to Advanced Answering Techniques. I'm your host, Josh. Uh, this is what I sound like. Caleb, let him hear a bit, a bit of what you sound like. I sound like this. And this Gabe, is my voice, the voice that God gave and that's, me. And that's good. Caleb and Gabe, let's hear more about what you sound like. Hey, this is Gabe. Hi. Let's hear about what you sound like, he said. about Hear about what I sound like? Yeah, let's that's hear a, about what you roughly. sound like. And that's well, about okay, it. If, that's <laughs> if you want to hear like about what I sound like, it's... It's kind of like that. Like that's close, but not exactly. It's not exactly. <laughs> it's about it's, what I said. It's sound. a little bit yeah. different. Yeah, guys, we've got a lot to get to today. We have a question 
Um, a little bit of an anecdote with a question from frequent collaborator Joy. This weekend I took my daughter to a uh, harvest festival out in the country where there was hay rides and pony rides and crafts, tons of fun stuff. And I put Marta on a pony ride and the guy who was going to help her, I stepped in and I was like, I grew up in the country, I know. I, my kids are so funny. They get so excited about animals, but it's like old hat to me. I don't know why I said that. I think I was trying to look up here cool because they all looked really cool in country. And um, I helped her on the pony and then I went to get out of the corral and I could not find the chain. And I was like, I've never seen a gate like this before. And I was at the hinge going, how do I get out? And he pointed to the other side of the gate and was like, I thought you said you grew up on a farm. And I was kind of embarrassed and all I said was, well, we had different gates than these. <laughs> um, but my question is, how do you guys impress people who are farmers? This is a really good question. I wow. love this question. <laughs> so many things about it. But one of the best best things I love is that Joy is on the right track. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you want to impress farmers, a good way, one good way to do that, not the only way, one good way to do that is to open a gate. Yeah. Yeah. That is one good way. It's a really good start. And perhaps to have no issue opening the gate. Just, right. Just yeah. walk up to it, open it immediately. Easily and, open yep. gates. Now, I am wondering mm -hmm. if Joy has different gates where she grew right. up, what the hell do these gates look right. like? Sure. They fold down. They're, well, they were chains on <laughs> chains on both sides. Chain, yeah. Yeah. You could open the gate either way. Either way. It was like the hinge Doesn't didn't really like matter. Yeah. Or right. could it be some kind of gate that like just disappears? You say yeah. a special word, gate disappears. Right. Yeah. Say another could word, be. gate appears again. Yeah, maybe could she's be. burying the lead and she grew up on a magic farm. Yeah, yeah magic some farm. kind of magic farm. Yeah. Or you press a or you get up to the gate and the gate sucks into the ground. Yeah. Right. Star it's, Trek farm. Yep. Yeah. Star Trek Star farm. Star Trek farm. But that's, but it is. Star Trek farm. If yeah. you do want to, it, it's the the tricky thing with opening a gate is that it is a serious gambit. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. You just don't know because gates is hard. Gates yeah. are different. Yep. You've got no, different gate gates. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. I mean, I'll, what I'd say is just, in, in, just start at a, kind of a starting point. One way of dealing with gates is bone up on latches. Mm -hmm. Do some serious study on latches. Yep. Get yep. hinge theory down. Hinge theory down. <laughs> <laughs> get, 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 yeah. Really dig into locking mechanisms. It's amazing what you can do on YouTube these days. Yeah. yeah. Hats been pinned. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. The Those philosophy are... of latch. Mm -hmm. You said latch already? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, so, that's good. Um, uh, the, the the treatise read read the treatise on sure. on right. doors. Hume even. go Hume, to doors. A little Hume bit. spent a lot of time on this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you could, between you can Hume about, and Kant, you I, can go. Yeah, you can go a long way. Uh, hey, very good. Uh, and, and I do think you could do if you read on doors. That's not too far, right? You no, know? you're going to be able to apply some door knowledge to gates. That's kind. That's kind of there, mm -hmm. there's a, there's some cross training with, with doors <laughs> and even windows. <laughs> Uh, okay, um, I did have some ideas initially um, about one way to um, to impress farmers. Mm -hmm. Now, I know that not all farmers listen to country music. As I understand it, there's some farmers that are really into rap. Mm -hmm. For instance, they like that rappers have cornrows. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, it's a good point of identification for them. Right. But they also identify with rappers who have dreads because farmers, for instance, let's think about a whole uh, infectious disease getting in, yeah. wiping out your herd, or rain doesn't come when you need it to. Yeah. Those are, th farmers have dreads too. They and dread about that. Right? There's, yeah. a, there's yeah. another uh, element here that is, I think, important to touch on, which is, um, you know, uh, flow. Right. Right. You need, to you need to have a good. A lot of guys are full or old. All our farmers are old men. Oh no! I wasn't. Oh, oh no! no, no <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No. I was mainly talking about like irrigation. Right, yeah. right, right. right. I like too. That's what I mean too. Like, right. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. but like yeah. for fields. Oh, right. And yes. Crops. Yes. 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 Yeah. yes, 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 yes. Right. Um, so that's so that so I think 
it, it's true that it's not just country music for farmers, but a lot of farmers do listen to country music. Mm -hmm. It's kind of primary for them. And one thing that you'll find in a lot of country songs is that farmers are, are not farmers, but country singers are dealing with <laughs> ideas that resonate with farmers. And one of the things country singers will spend a lot of time on is women in tight pants, and they don't understand it mm -hmm. quite. Right. For instance, they think that there's a lot of country songs. This goes back to Dolly Parton, and I did a little bit of research. But the idea of women... Was that a fun time doing this it, research? It was. Okay. It was women that there's in a lot of country songs, there's an idea of women painting on their jeans. <laughs> yeah. I think we talked about this before. Yeah. Yeah. But but that goes back to... She, she, Dolly Parton says that these women have jeans painted on right. in multiple songs through the years, through the decades. The, the country singers have struggled with the idea of maybe women are painting their jeans off. <laughs> right, which is really gets rid of the idea of the jeans being uh, protective or what well, the amazing well, thing about jeans is, that they're durable. And they're durable, sure. and, and you would think that farmers, they grow cotton. They would understand mm -hmm. something about how this works, right? But that, but the, but they they seem to struggle with it. Another thing that they struggle, if you'll remember the song, "Honky Donk, Honky Tonk, but Donk a Donk" by yes. Trace Adkins. <laughs> I know the song. He just he just comes straight out with a question. He says, "How does she even get the britches on?" <laughs> yeah, yeah. He doesn't yeah. understand pants. So uh, that is crazy because you, yeah. And again, farmers if it's painted on, they understand how they get them on. Right. Well, if it if that but, was true, so but they he's getting a little bit closer to the he's, point. He's closer. <laughs> yeah, he he's understands closer. a little bit more. About he, he's, he has these aren't painted on. No, he he's like, but, but how but, but still how, how yeah. do they get these britches yeah. on? Yes, yes. Um so And that's uh, sexy to say britches. It's very right. sexy. Um and so that to me is where it's a good place to start. You assume that the country singers are singing about things that resonate with farmers. So sit down with a farmer and just try to explain pants yes. mm -hmm. to him. Jeans or just pants? I think general. jeans. Yeah, I mean, yeah. you just get like good. Get get. Sure. I'll leave you a little bit closer. Yes. Yeah. Just just work up to jeans. Yes. Yeah. Maybe you could get to jeans. Yeah. You start with britches. Start with learn about doors and you move on to gates. Right. Start with britches. Yeah. The general yeah. idea yeah. of britches. Yeah. Yeah, and I, so so anyway, that's 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 what I'd say. You want to impress a farmer, get into the mysteries of pants. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, and, and that's unfold some of that for them. I think they'll be very impressed. Unfold it. I like yeah. that too. That's great. Yeah. yeah. Um. Wow. Okay. So for me, <laughs> did you have something you want to say, Gabe? No, I was okay. just thinking about the mysteries of pants. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Um, it's you know I, if you've ever tried to make some pants. It's not exactly straightforward. No, it isn't. It's pretty difficult. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah The yeah. idea of making clothes, I take it for granted. Right. If mm -hmm. I had to make my own clothes, oh. people would really understand how little I know about yeah. clothing. I mean, I would probably pretty quickly <laughs> just resort to painting everything on. Yeah, I would paint things on, or I'd be wearing like one big sheet with a hole in the top right. and holes in the sides. You okay. know? Yeah. Like, I get why people were doing that when you weren't mass producing clothes. Absolutely. It's just like one big, I get it. It yeah. makes sense. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's partially why pants are, are mysterious. Right. Yeah. Yes. 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 It's an advanced a form. Mystery. It's a van it's a sign of an advanced technology. Yeah. Uh, advanced civilization, advanced culture. Exactly. Yeah. Um, okay. Well, for me, if I can go next, Gabe, yeah. if that's Please. okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, for me, one way that I think you can imp uh, impress a farmer mm -hmm. is uh, you just show him how good you are at herding sheep. Yes. Mm. And uh, and so if you can show him how good you are, you can help him win, you know, some kind of mm. sheep herding competition right. or something. I think he's gonna be pretty impressed. With That's you. gonna be very impressive. Yeah. Now, yep. just I'm just gonna let's put this theory up on some on legs and yeah. see, yeah. you know, how it works. Yeah, yeah. If you have maybe shown that you struggle with gates, yeah, and that. The whole the thing, then putting the sheep, because I would assume that the competition has some, you know, getting them into a, a yes, you know, but a corral the way, and the way that you're paddock. herding the sheep, you're not going to be dealing with gates. You don't have oh. to even farmer, worry about the gates. The farmer is going to be dealing with the gates. Right. Oh, you okay. are herding the sheep. Right. You're herding them. Well, you're not. Hopefully, like, yeah. You're, you might have to threaten herding okay, them. Okay. But you're uh, down on all fours. Yeah. Herding the sheep. Herding, herding. I see. Yes. H e r d i n g. In the way that you wouldn't expect a border collie to open the gate and close it after right. the sheep. Right. Gate 
knowledge. Right. The, yeah. the, 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 this, the mysteries of gates is a closed gate to sheepdogs. This is really good. This is, this is actually speaking directly to Joy. Mm. Right. She will not mm-hmm. have to worry right. yeah. about the gates. About the gates. Yeah. Don't yeah. worry about the gates. You don't yeah. have to impress this a farmer a good, through yeah. using gates. Yeah. You show him how you can earn sheep. You can right. earn sheep. You're Just going to impress <laughs> that farmer. Start running around. <laughs> <laughs> yelling you don't at have him. to get on all fours. No, That's no, going to be no. pretty ineffective for you, yeah. right. probably. I don't know what you... Yeah, I don't yeah. know. I've seen some people who can go pretty fast on all yeah. fours. But... Um, if that's not your way, that's fine. But you're getting out there, you're growling at mm-hmm. she. Okay. You do need to growl. Yep. You got to have a growl. You probably do have to growl. Yeah. It's the language or they snapping. understand. Yeah. Yep. Snapping a little bit, you know. Um, but maybe if you do it right, you know, uh, some sheeps. I don't know. I, I, I got this. There's a movie I watched that kind of helped me understand mm. mm-hmm. how to impress a farmer. Yeah. Okay. And in it, the main character does have to learn how to herd sheep. Yeah. Right. Uh, but he gets secret knowledge. Right. That helps him herd the sheep. Yeah. Okay. In a different kind of way. Yeah. I'm not saying you that's going to happen. Maybe that will happen for yeah. you. Yeah. But I'm saying you got to put the hard work in of learning yeah. how to do what the dogs do first, I think. Right. Yes. But and it, then maybe that secret knowledge, maybe you'll be initiated into the society right. of sheep language right well and the nice thing is i think i've seen the movie you're referring is that referring to is that um uh you know he doesn't even really look like a dog no like he just looks kind of like you know like a naked man pink skin yeah Yeah. and he's you know so it's it's kind of like you don't even it's not even just all about looks right no 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 it is uh, about secret knowledge secret knowledge your attitude yeah yeah, uh, uh, and the kind of the manifesting, f- yes, yes, having an intention, yeah. right? Having an intention, manifesting it in the world, but also communication, mm. you know. Mm-hmm. Um, and maybe if you figure out that you're just you didn't get that secret knowledge, then I think it is best to just resort back to if you want to impress the farmer, right? That's the goal here, yeah. You know, your life might be on the line, right? It could be, um, <laughs> uh, yeah. and so. Uh, if right. you want to impress the farmer, I that's my opinion. Well, yeah, your life is on the line in the sense that if you don't prove your worth in herding the sheep, then you might end up being Christmas dinner. Right. Or something like right. that. You, you know? might be Christmas dinner, you yeah. might be uh you might be um Easter dinner. Easter dinner. Right. Okay, good. Okay. Um you might be um let me get one. Um <laughs> It might be Halloween dinner. <laughs> Halloween <laughs> dinner. <laughs> right. <laughs> you might. You might. Let me get another one. Just okay. Well, I was might, just going to add okay, on. Go you, ahead. You, take a second. Okay. Um, and uh, and um, you you might be there. Might be, yeah. Keep thinking. Uh, um, you might be what's what fueling the children to go up and do. get that candy. Yeah. That's okay. Sure. Good. Good. Yes. Yeah. Um, okay. But then that was Halloween. another dinner. That's yeah. Halloween. Yeah. I know. I know. I know about Halloween. Yeah. Here's a, here's another it question. Might be, uh, did you say Thanksgiving? No, no. No, it might be Thanksgiving dinner. But that might... doesn't really make sense because you're not a turkey. Um, yeah. That's true. But people do all kinds of things to make things seem like turkey these days. That's anyway, true. I'm, I'm, not saying, I'm not saying you will be. I said you might, might. be. Yeah, that's might true. Be. That's a good point. You could be. Yeah. What, what is a traditional Halloween dinner? <laughs> Traditional Halloween dinner. A bunch of Kit Kats? No, no, no. You're you're about to have all that. Oh, okay. So you gotta make room. So, so yeah, you gotta start off. It's with, actually just with a with just kind of a moderate number of Kit Kats. <laughs> okay. Just a normal just what you yeah, would have right. on a normal weekday. Yeah. If you want that taste in there, that's good. But yeah. I think you, you take a you take a huge dose of castor oil to just kinda empty out. <laughs> yeah, get ready. Get ready for the night Get activities. ready so that so that, that candy can hit you <laughs> As hard as possible. It's gonna <laughs> the the melted chocolate covering of Kit Kat is gonna yep. melt. It's not even yeah. gonna melt on the way down. Right. It's gonna melt on your stomach lining. Yep. Mm. No, nothing. I there. see. I yeah. see. You're not it's losing gonna, anything on the it's way down. Gonna stick to the ribs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, you know, for me, I think there's a reason that they're farmers. You know, and it's because farmers are not that smart, and so they have to work in the fields right. and stuff like that. Right? Like that's yeah. You know, um, so a lot, and this this is true of a lot of people, but a lot of people find magic very impressive, right? So, okay, I think if you want to impress farmers, which you know maybe are 
I mean, I would say definitely are below average IQ. Yeah. Because they dumb live as out, bricks. Well, yeah, they live out in the country. We all know right. smart people live in the city. Yep. Right. So, um, you know, interesting. Interesting. If, if you yeah. want to, if you want to impress them, uh, if you don't know how to do like a very sophisticated card trick, you can always there's the you know like the thumb trick where right. you pretend that yeah. you're removing your thumb. Yeah. Right. And I think, I think probably ninety five percent of farmers that you meet would be absolutely uh, amazed by that trick. Yeah. I don't think there's there's not really going to be any follow up other than like how did how yeah. did you do that. Right. And, you know, you obviously you get to play the I can't reveal. Right. I'm a magician. A magician magician. doesn't reveal his secrets. Exactly. His or her secrets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I think it might be kind of tricky, though, because, like you say, these are dumb, dumb dumbs. Yeah. Right. We live in the country. Uh, yeah, like a bunch of when idiots. they do that, work yeah. with their hands. Right, they lose fingers. Well, see, this is I. So this is touching. Maybe on Maybe they're kind of like is this. P- isn't actually this is uh, extremely terrifying to me. Yes. Well, one, or uh, so what? No, yeah. here's well, here's, right. but, but I think putting it back exactly. Is, <laughs> it's gonna be this. Okay. I had followed this line through, and I was yeah. thinking, well, okay, yes, they're out there using their hands, right. heavy machinery. Sometimes a digit is lost here or there. Yeah. yeah, but it will be that thing of they will not, they will not have seen you, right. seen somebody remove their thumb yeah. intentionally or otherwise. And then replace and it then immediately, replace, and, and it functions, really and there's no That's seam or anything yeah. like that. So, even if you do encounter the you know the odd farmer that is that has seen, yeah. uh, or maybe has you know lopped off their own fingers, yeah. or right, something right. like that. Um, the the replacing will be. Just Don't you think that's kind of astounding. asking for a world of hurt? Though the farmers are going to be like, okay, I need. No, I have a couple. I have it. a couple that I need. Oh, you to. Or get back, put back. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's that is a good question. And I mean, and you say, okay, well, uh, let's let's where go, is go it? grab me the, sure. the end of that thumb. Yeah, we'll see if we can get it back on. And you're hoping and you're they go just praying that they don't, don't have it. Have it. <laughs> don't have like a, a little a little spot in their freezer. freezer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just, yeah, just digits. <laughs> yeah, just in case. I mean, but then you meet that guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Let's say you meet. Okay, that. let's, let's, say you let's do that it. Me and you, we'll okay. do it. I'm a farmer. I have no fingers on one hand. Okay. <laughs> I am. I, wow. I, or you do the trick. First, okay. So I'm I'm doing, okay. Yeah, and yeah. Uh, yeah. So I know it looks like I struggled with that gate earlier, but it's because uh, you know I was a little uh, worried about my my thumb coming off. It, it comes off pretty easily, right? And what? Oh. Yeah, but, oh! oh don't, don't worry. Don't worry. I could put it right back on. Oh. Oh yeah. my goodness! Pretty cool, huh? Fantastic work! Thank you. My goodness, I'm impressed, but I won't be impressed. <laughs> Unless... Well, okay, hang on. <laughs> Can we start over? Why? Well, you let slip that you were already impressed, <laughs> which the whole the whole I... premise was. But that... I think it's okay. I think okay, okay. No, no. I think it's okay for me to say that because okay. I am impressed. You start impressed, but then does the are you do you continue to be impressed? We want long lasting Im- impression. impression. Yeah, yeah. So maybe this farmer could say that was impressive, but I I feel that my the how impressed I was is quickly fading. Okay, mm-hmm. that's what I'll do. Okay, yeah. Let's do it again. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. So I can remove my thumb and put it back on. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Wow, that impressed me, but I can feel that the impressiveness of that is fading quickly. And as you see, I have no fingers on this hand. Yeah. And so I was wondering if you could potentially put them back. Um, I it's I can only do it for my own fingers. What? <laughs> it's true. It's a magician's. Why? It's the magician's code. Why? Yeah. It's, yeah. That's right. Uh, it's the magician's you, code. So you can only do it for your own fingers. Yeah, yeah. and now only my I'm, thumb. <laughs> now I'm on just your thumb. And only my thumb. <laughs> I'm and just now the I'm one pissed. Time. Oh, okay. I'm actually kind of angry. And and that is kind of another sort of impression you yeah. could leave on somebody. Yeah. You could, okay. You can could we do it again? Where where I have to go to the fridge and get my fingers out of the fridge? Let's just cut <laughs> to you going to the fridge. Yeah, okay. go get the fridge. Okay, I go to the fingers. fridge. Okay. 
clip clop, clip clop. That's me walk. <laughs> that yeah, farmer yeah. sounds like a horse. <laughs> <laughs> He's around horses so much. Yeah. Clip clop, clip clop. Okay, let me get off my horse. I was riding the horse back to the Oh, house. he's riding Okay, the horse. now I'm walking yeah. to my home. Clip, clop, clip, right. clop, clip, clop, clip, mm-hmm. clop, clip, clop, clip, clop. Go to my fridge. Okay, unlock my fridge. There's a there's a door. Inside. <laughs> and I unlock it. There's a grate, a kind of gate okay. in front of this specific. F- it's a freezer. It's not a fridge. No, sorry. It is a fridge. But then I unlock this part, and that's and inside, a freezer. And then there's a freezer Good. part. Yeah, I've inside. seen those before. Okay, so then I go in there. Okay, let's see which one is which. Which one is which? And uh, you can tell it's kind of taking longer because I it can is only use longer. Yeah. I can <laughs> only <laughs> use one hand. I'm really feeling how long it's been. Yeah. Okay, which one is the it? fall okay, festival might be over by this by the time okay, you get back. I think it's so. And then as I'm opening it and taking it out, I'm thinking about yeah. this is so weird. All my fingers are holding my other fingers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I come back to you. Okay. With my fingers. Yeah. Other fingers. Yeah. I just wanted to show you these. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Thank you. And and that will happen with a farmer. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's part of it. Yeah. Um. So guys, let's sum up a little bit here. Um. One thing that we like to do is kind of find the through line and try mm-hmm. to understand the technique in a little more depth. Yeah. yeah. We've been demonstrating a technique. That's what this podcast is all about. Showing you. Yeah. How you should approach answers. What's the technique that we'd really like to leave folks with today? I, Basically, my uh, I'll I'll just go back to my initial answer was explain pants to a farmer. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, the country music has shown us that they resonate with the idea that pants are complicated. Right. Right. So you could you could do that. Uh, I think you know with my idea, it's it's uh, just knowing that you are smarter. Than right. this other person, I think that kind of runs along that, that's with true. what you're saying. Yep. And be I, confident. I don't want to speak for you, Caleb, but yeah, yeah, there is a there is an element I could say that you could ast- sure, extrapolate no, no, go from ahead, that, let's hear what you have to say about my thing. To, well, I mean, I'm, no, 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 no. It's you not know, a if we're trying to tr- just tie it all together. No, 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 here. It makes total sense. It, yeah, it's I'm kind of the farmer of the group. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just what I'm. Well, no, 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 no. Yeah. I, what I mean is that, like, if you are going to like basically you're like tricking a farmer into thinking that you're like a herd like a herding animal well, or something tricking or i guess them. you tricking are them. no you're impressing yeah. the farmer okay so it does fall apart there my my thing you're does impressing fall the apart. farmer by herding the sheep in a way that he goes yeah but here's the thing is is the farmer do, look, that'll do man yeah. yeah the farmer looked at you and said well not this 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 individual Will not be able to herd sheep, right? And that was his stupid mistake. There you go. That's his dumb, That's dumb, yeah. dumb mistake. Yeah. And so, yeah, you you do prove to the farmer that you are smarter than him yeah. by herding the sheep. By and the, her, the her technique, the sheep. by so, doing exactly yeah. what he tells you to do. You prove to the farmer that you can hear his whistling, and you're going to do exactly yeah. what he what yeah. he whistles for. <laughs> and it doesn't matter that you had trouble with the gate, right? right. Because yeah. that's not what he wants out of you. Yeah, he wants you to herd the sheep. Yeah. And I think that that is... And that's how you put him in his place. Well, that's the technique that's on and display And put the sheep in their place. Yeah, you're not wrong. Yeah, they're that's right where they what, need to be. You want to answer something in a way that it puts the person in their place. It wouldn't really feel like an mm-hmm. answer. The gate of that answer won't click close. Right. Unless you've really damaged their standing yeah. in their own eyes. Uh, okay. Yeah. I was just thinking, like, they're, if you put them in their place, you know, uh, yeah. sheep don't like being out and about. Yeah. Um, they want to be in their place. Right. Farmers want to be, be in a tractor or a barn. Right. Or honky-tonk. Yeah. Or, yeah, or painting a pair of jeans on. Yeah. Yeah, farmers are painting the jeans on. Yeah. They go, wait, I've been spending all this money on jeans. Uh, yeah. And you can simply paint you them can on. Simply paint them on. Yeah. And I just have all this paint. <laughs> yeah. For have, free. Now I'm wearing red jeans. Yeah. Yeah. Because farmers' barns right. are red. Are yeah. red. That's good. <laughs> and, yeah. So just remember that you're probably smarter than whoever 
you're dealing with, and that's yes. Well, farmers specifically. When you yeah, approach, definitely. When yeah. you approach, yeah. but but we want to extrapolate this answer Broad, broader, broadly. Yeah. Um, and we want to say that, like, yes, when you go to deal with a question that somebody has, you should immediately assume your own superiority, mm-hmm. your higher intelligence. Why did they ask you a question? Why are they asking yeah. why you? Did they ask? Why are they? Asking why are they asking you asking a question? You? Yep, they're asking you a question because you obviously look like someone who has the answers. And at all costs, you must maintain that. That status. It's all about status. Yeah. Crush them and prove to them that you do have your advanced answering techniques. That's the show, everybody. Thanks so much for listening. Um, My voice just did the milk bubble thing. (laughs) And now it's time for us to request from you that you send in questions. We're looking for questions about a minute in length, where, and you can send those as audio files to advancedansweringtechniques at gmail.com. And don't think that you're dumb for asking us questions. That's actually a smart move because one of the worst things that you can do if you are, have a question is ask the wrong person ask is for an answer now you're just now you're just confused it's just like me pappy used to tell me yeah that the next best thing to know is knowing where to find out right and this is where and you can find this out is it. thank you guys hey thank, thank you. you congratulations yeah, congratulations good work, work Ready? out there yeah. hands, hands, in. hands in hands up hands up hands down hands down and that's out. Bye. 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 I'm living the sample life. Living the sample life. Watching the corn grow. Watching the dogs go as they hinder my wife. Orchard buried my daddy nice and deep. Buried my daddy in the orchard. He gonna get that everlasting sleep as he goes, as he goes. Hey. Sample life, watching the corn grow, watching the dogs go, 